two point five, lovely lady's mansion. Devata, around your mansion there are very beautiful mandarava trees, and they are covered with blue, yellow, black, crimson, and red flower filaments. You are wearing a garland of mandarava flowers on your head. This beautiful type of tree is not found in any other heaven. Famous Devata, what meritorious deed did you do to be reborn in the Thavatimsa heaven? Bhante, in the human world, there is a city called Kimbila. There, I was a female lay follower of the Supreme Buddha. My name was Buddhati. I had unshakable faith in the Triple Gem. I practiced the precepts and delighted in giving and sharing. Furthermore, I had confidence in the noble monks who had pure minds. I offered robes, food, shelter, and lamps. I was eager to observe the eight precepts four times a month on each of the four moon phases. I led a restrained life and was very generous. I abstained from killing, stealing, lying, and taking intoxicants. I did not cheat on my husband. I was delighted to keep these five precepts every day. I was wise enough to realize the Four Noble Truths. That is how I became a dedicated follower of Gautama's Supreme Buddha. The compassionate sages, Arahant Sariputta and Arahant Moggallana, are the two chief disciples of the Supreme Buddha. One day, I offered alms to them and collected lots of merit from that offering. I also observed the eight precepts four times a month frequently. As a result, when I left the human world, I was reborn in this heaven. Now I enjoy divine pleasures in the heavenly Nandana Park. My beauty radiates in all directions. <laughs>